Get yep, this going. Go ahead. All right. Hey, here we are. We are predictions. Predictions. I talked both these guys into actually sticking their neck out a little bit because you know they like to play the center of the road. <laughs> we're not gonna. We're not gonna go as far as name guys that we think are gonna go. We kind of did through did that for each of the um, each of the divisions, and you can see that this is more. What do we think the number is going to be? Let me give you guys, you may not know this. Let me give you some statistics here. In 2019, last year at the state tournament, we had, the UWL had 37 qualifiers, mm -hmm. 16 state placers, seven finalists, five state champions, and two teams in the top five. Now, obviously, that's phenomenal. That's mm -hmm. phenomenal. In 2018, mm -hmm. the year before that, we had 25 qualifiers. So what is that? 12 less people going to Columbus but 21 placers, five wow. more. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. So we sent 25, we got 21 on the podium. And we had four state champions and one team in the top five. So I think what we should do is, let, let's just make a prediction here. We'll use the whiteboard and let's just go through what you think. I just need the numbers. I don't need the names, gotcha. but just tell me what you think. So Where you um, with yourself? I'll, I'll start with myself first. And I have these numbers kind of top secret here. So this is Alliance, right? Yep. All right, I can't read my handwriting. I'm going to have to skip Alliance for a second. I'm going to go one and three, and then I'm going to count them up while you guys are doing it. In Division One, I have seven. In Division Three, I have twelve. You, Stevie, you do three out, or do do yours. I got to I got to tally up mine again. All right, Division uh, Three, I have ten. Division One, I have four. You want me to do two, D2? Yeah. D2, I have... I don't want to do it, though, because you're going to change it. I have 22. So, that'll give me a what? I'm, I'm no math major, but 36, that look like. Okay. Coach. Um, uh, Dondi, what do you got, D1? All right, D1, I only had three. Three. Shame to say. And D2. I died, Lord, I hope I'm wrong. D2, 20. Okay. D3. Eight. I have 23 here. I think it's obvious to see who believes in our kids and who doesn't. <laughs> oh, anyway, no! <laughs> 12. So what is that? I got 42. Boys. You're eclipsing the old record by... By five. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're right there. Which, what's uh, yeah. what's Rich have? 31? 31. Yeah. Well, you're in the ballpark. Yeah. I and mean, I think this is clearly going to be the closest. Well, I think we're going to find out, right? All right. I believe in the. I, I believe in the league. It almost looks like it's somewhere in the middle. <laughs> it almost looks like the guy who really believes in the kids, and a guy who doesn't, and a guy who sits in the middle of the road. Some would call this guy the realist. <laughs> uh, uh... Hey, uh, been a lot of fun this year. We want to say a couple of things. One, just to review a couple of things, and that is. Uh, we had four teams win sectional championships this past week. We had Fitch, Canfield, South Range, Louisville. We had four runners up, right? We had Boardman, Beaver Local, Waterloo, and Alliance. Um, we're, we're excited about, we, we are an official media outlet. We will be at the state tournament on Press Row. We'll be following there. We'll be this weekend at Alliance. We're gonna try to tweet some results. If you have some, please send them to us. Uh, this is the best 10 days of the season. This yeah, is the most exciting sure time of the year. It's going to be something. Um, I'm yeah, excited. Me so. too. Anything right. else? No, that's it. Now, good, good luck, luck, guys. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Yep.